Health news from the How Did That Happen file. Young man in Mexico reportedly suffered a stroke and died as a result of getting a hickey from his girlfriend. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez found out not as far fetched as it may sound. Doctor. Well, let me start out, guys, by saying I was very skeptical when I was assigned this story. But when I called a nationally known stroke neurologist at New York Presbyterian Columbia, he told me that it was possible, rare, but possible. Hickeys are practically a rite of passage for our teenage years, so much so they were even immortalized in this famous scene from the movie Grease. But it was much less entertaining when a published report said that a young man in Mexico City died after suffering a stroke authorities attributed to a hickey from his girlfriend. Really? Well, a hickey is uh, like a bruise over the skin, yeah, so it's uh, some injury to the uh, surface of the skin. Noted stroke specialist Dr. Mitchell Elkin says a skin bruise like a hickey would not lead to a stroke. But surprisingly, there have been reports in medical journals of relatively minor trauma to the neck from coughing, sneezing, roller coasters actually leading to strokes. So Dr. Elkin says a hickey could conceivably lead to a stroke if the hickey is applied especially aggressively to a certain area of the neck. So the carotid artery, which is one of the uh, arteries that goes to the brain, travels through the neck. So uh, if somebody were to press on or otherwise damage the, the neck in that area where the carotid artery is going, uh, potentially they could, they could cause enough injury to tear the blood vessel and, and, and cause a blood clot to form that can then go to the brain and cause a stroke. But Dr. Elkin says this would be an extremely rare event and parents have very little to worry about hickeys strokes and their teens. Now, Dr. Elkin also said it's people with some genetic connective tissue disorders that might make their arteries especially fragile that might have to worry about hickeys. Or you could just avoid putting a hickey on a neck altogether. Okay. Thank you, Dr. Thank Max. You. Well,